it was so quick. Another vehicle's coming. Sorry, in the way again. Where's my hat? Away. I don't know what to say now. I'm completely blown. I would speculate on she would swim and when she would bring them up and when she would move them. Thank uh -huh. 
Formulation to shock in this fact, it's a matter of seconds. I don't know what it is about this sort of thing. You know, we, I've seen impala lambs being eaten alive. I've seen buffalo calves being eaten. I've seen all sorts of things. But the death of a young leopard somehow, I don't know why, maybe it's because we imbue them with such majesty and, and, and such importance. And because the impala are so numerous that when an impala lamb gets taken by a wild dog or a baboon or a whatever. It's almost as a it's an acceptable thing. We, we, it's, it's a common occurrence that it becomes what becomes desensitized a little bit. And at the end of the day, oh, I don't like that phrase. But basics of it all is that it is merely it's life and death out here that's what it is we, we, we drive around view wildlife as it happens it's, it's what it's all about it's what it's what one can't choose what to watch what not to watch if you want to come and explore nature you want to experience nature that is what nature has to offer. Nature has its beauty and its wonderful magical moments. But that harshness that does exist, that harshness that one comes across every now and then, sh shouldn't really affect us very much. We just for years. Our paths diverged from that of the natural world so long ago that we had our modern lives and our technology. Well, Male was trying to entice the female. So he's moved off now. Thank you. 